Alrighty, everybody, we're back. Thank you for being patient. Hopefully you enjoyed Fall Guys, that was fun. That was really fun. Also, uh, Niju, thank you so much for the host. I, as soon as you hosted me, I was literally about to take a break and also saying bye to Kay Woody, so I apologize. But thank you so much for the host as well. Um, what were you playing today? I don't know if we gave you a shout out, let's see. I'm gonna give you a shout out right now, I'm sorry about that. Anyone from Niju's stream as well, welcome. Let's see. Playing Portal 2, nice. I haven't actually played uh, Portal 2 for so long. I tried it once and I got scared of it. It's kind of freaky. Alrighty, let's uh, let's Earth's continue this one. Granted, so, the world might so we have two hours, 23 minutes on this so far. We're probably gonna put like another two hours on it right now, so. Let's go. It's dangerous to go alone, take this. Uh, Lux Susan, thank you for the seven months. Welcome back, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Malik, so it doesn't really go that well with this kind of game. Plus, I already started the playthrough without it, so I can't add it to the playthrough on the second episode. It wouldn't really make any sense. But, uh, yeah, typically I don't really use a face cam for the stream. It's not really that complimentary for everything. Depends on, uh, what it is. Hopefully that's acceptable for you. Alrighty, let's see. Where are we going? Forgot you can't swim. Wait, let's check the map. What, what are the what are the controls again? So we have L1 for the map. We have our attack. We have you have to hold B to heal, right? And then you can jump. So we're actually supposed to be going all the way down here, down this way. It's always complimentary to Cipher. Thanks, man. It's very nice. Of you. I'm glad. I'm glad that you think that, but. To be fair, it, it is definitely not what I prefer to do for immersive stuff. Especially like runs and stuff like that, depending depending on what it is. Oh boy. Oh, I'm so hyped, what do you think about the game? I like it, it's good. Has really good music. Um, like, I actually thought my Spotify was playing still when I turned it on. Uh oh. Hmm, wait. Okay, we're going the right way. The accidental muting was hilarious. I should not have assigned those buttons. That was my fault. Definitely on my fault. Oh, I died. Yay. All right, well, we lost whatever we had then. I have conquered Fall Guys. I hope so. Uh, Sierra, thank you so much again for the 20 gifted subs. That was, inc that was absolutely crazy. <clears throat> you did not need to do that at all. Uh, completely unnecessary. We're gonna make that very, very clear, and then we're gonna refund you for being crazy. Uh, no, I'm doing pretty good. How are you? Oh shit. Not good. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> Happy you're enjoying the game, Seekero is. Dude, Kook, thank you for the bits, man. That's crazy. What What are you doing? What? I am enjoying the game. It's actually really nice. Um, I bet you there's so many people that like this game that are happy about this. So, like, it's it's definitely cool that we're doing it because I it's, it's gonna it's gonna get me ready for the next game coming out too. Oh my god. I forgot you have to kill your uh, shadow. A whole whopping zero points. I forgot you could jump so high in this too. I should probably be using the D-pad. Oh. 
apparently that hurt me. Oh, that hurt me too. Yay. Alright, let's heal. Defeated the Hornet yet? Um, I don't believe I have. I think that's a spoiler. Well, maybe not, because I, I think I know what you're talking about. I'm pretty sure I've seen it for speedruns and stuff, just because... Um, I know that... Um, I know a lot of people that played this. So I've, I, I know I've seen a lot of characters. I just don't know what they're called or where you find them necessarily in relation to where I am right now. But I, if I saw it, I'd probably be like, yep, I recognize that. Oh, we're over here. Okay. Have we already, we've already gone this way though, right? Hmm. Apparently there's another traveler, so that, oh, that is the Hornet. That is the Hornet, sorry. The Hornet is not a boss. It's the character from Silk Song, right? So, so I guess we did see that. I think that's who he's talking about. Where does this go down into? Oh, the slam jam, GG. Am I gonna 112% this game? I don't know if I'm gonna 112% the game, we'll see. Uh, is the playthrough gonna be on YouTube? The first part of it already is. Uh, second part will be on there by tomorrow. Or actually, you know what, no, no, no. Um, second part, I'm going to wait, <clears throat> excuse me, because the first part's kind of short. So what I want to do is, uh, compile the next two streams together for this. If we're going to, if we're going to do like another couple hours or a few hours, put it into like a block of like five hours or so. I should have done that with the first part. I completely forgot though. I was being silly. So I definitely will, um, we'll kind of like group them together. So it'll probably take like another couple streams before I put the other part on there. Um... Man, I'm lost in this area. Okay. Ah! Uh, can I fall down there? Oh, damn it. I forgot there's a plow. Dude, I am not in Hollow, Hollow Knight mode right now. I want to see if I can fall right to this. I guess, I guess it doesn't really matter. We don't really have a lot of currency that we can like really save anyways. <laughs> you gotta zoom in on the map? Oh, you can zoom- what? Wait. How? How did I change? How come it looked different before? Uh, Jara, thank you for the, the five gifted subs, man. I appreciate that. I hope you enjoy your emotes, guys. Please say thank you to Jara if you don't. Or if you didn't and you just don't say thank you to people, then I'm gonna make you say thank you to them. That is insane, dude. Thank you very much. Um, it was zoomed out before. I don't know how to do that. I thought that was, I thought the map changes based on where you are. Um, oh, B. B and then A, sorry. It doesn't say that when you open it, though. Wait, how did it, what? How come it changed? Okay, no, no button will make it zoom in from here. It just does that. Holding the map button via double tapping it. I am, I am, you have to push it twice? What? Why is that a thing? That is such a weird, I've never heard of a game having a double tap a button for a menu. That's so, okay. That, now I feel a lot less stupid. I thought I was actually like completely hopeless there. I don't even know if it, if it, if I saw a thing where it said that you could double tap it. It's crazy that three people made this song, including the composer. That's insane. Wow. I mean, this whole, this whole game is not really made by a lot of people as far as I know, so. It's one of the best indie games I've seen.
Oh, I guess we're gonna get our stuff back. Three people from Australia made Hollow Knight. Really? That's not good. Hmm. Okay, so I think we're, we're, we're heading over here originally, weren't we? So the world might be mended. Squilla killer. My type. Nice. Uh, Skio, thank you for the 34 months, man. Welcome back. How's it going? I have a question. Skio, have you played Fall Guys? And, and are you going to stream it? Or have you? Damn it. Uh, Strawberry, thank you for the uh, the Prime sub. I appreciate that. Wow, giving me your Prime sub. Just because we played Fall Guys. And secretly, does, secretly doesn't even like the content. Just likes the Fall Guys. I appreciate that. No, that's that's very nice of you. Um, apparently, I have to call you Tal or like T. -t I have to like your name is pronounced T. -t or T. -t <laughs> Something like that. So now I'm part of the uh, group of people calling you that, but not understanding why. Yeah. It's T. -t 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 <laughs> to get to get T. -t You'd like to? You'd like to? You're gonna add it to your library? Definitely, if you get a chance, man. It's a, it's a great game, in my opinion. It might be fun because I know that you sometimes do like variety stuff, and uh, I used to like PvP with viewers, right? So it's a good viewer game. I'm gonna kill this guy. Get dunked. My lack of healing makes you nervous. I'm sorry. I'm getting back into the swing of things with this. So we've still been over here. We have to go down. It's just a bribe so you'll continue carrying my ass in team games. You did really good. I think you played better than me the entire time. I just got lucky probably for some of the, the stuff. I saw you get unlucky too. I saw you miss like... It looked like you landed on the platform, but you just got like pushed off or whatever for the hex game. So sometimes they're a little, a little tricky. But thank you so much for doing that. I really appreciate it. How was the feedback for face cam? Uh, luckily you guys could control yourselves this time a little bit better than than last time there was some there was nothing along the lines of like what happened before like before it was like uncomfortable so um as far as that goes like it's fine I know it's fine it's mainly it's not that I was trying to actually bring it back or anything I was literally just doing it for something that like makes sense where you are more expressive and excited and all that whereas if I'm playing something that's more of like a first playthrough I might be paying more attention just staring at the screen or, you know, if I'm playing a uh, run that I know really well and I'm hardcore about it, like, I'm probably not even going to really have many emotions during the process, so... Uh, like, facial expressions wouldn't even translate, really. There wouldn't really be any... crazy ones, right? <laughs> so, I feel like that's kind of boring, in my opinion, to have a face cam for that. But Fall Guys, man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get excited. I think we already been here. Yes, we have. Wait, what? So this is this is basically going back to where we were. Because Green Path is new, isn't it? Damn it. All right, let's go through Green, green Path again. Speed run time. High functioning uh, autistic, your face doesn't want, doesn't do what people want it to. Hence why face rig is a blessing. Oh, do you use face rig, skill? Like the one where you can have like the little character thing? 
I guess that's a, yeah, that's a thing too. It's like expressions might not come across for like people for various cases, right? I think for me just it doesn't really, um, it's not my thing. I've never been a person that uh, will get your attention with uh, like doing much other than regular shit. So if you're going to be here and enjoy the stuff and see what it is, you'll probably figure out if it's good or not. But if you want to see something like get your attention immediately, I don't know if anything I can do is going to be that amazing, right? Now, if someone goes in a stream with face cam and the guy's like literally doing jumping jacks or backflips, like of course you're gonna probably want to stay, even if the game's not even a thing you want to see, because something weird is happening, or if there's something you're uncertain of that's like you know, it's like unpredictable, you know, maybe maybe very maybe very like hype, very very explosive, very loud. It's like okay, sure, I want to see what's gonna happen because you don't know. That's why I feel like watching Tyler 1, it's like he, he, anything could happen. The wall could literally fall through. He could punch a hole in the wall. He could eat his own face. He could play the game really well and not do that. Or he could just say something hilarious and walk, like run around. I don't know. Who knows? But that's the hook because it's unpredictable. You know. Why don't you do backflips? I can't backflip on flat, so <laughs> give me a trampoline. We can we can negotiate, but let me let me work on that first. What kind of treachery is this? Mana break? There was. There was supposed to be one. There's not for this playthrough. Like I was saying, it was a bet for uh, me and uh, Gino. I was only going to do it 10 times, and I'll probably just have it on when I do Fall Guys. I think that's a good idea. Because, again, like there is some hilarious things that happen. Oh. Can't even jump. He didn't eat his face already? He's well I mean like maybe one day. Who knows? Let's hope not. Just the energy levels are so abundant that it's like his face is gonna turn inside out. He's gonna turn into like a titan or something. Oh man. Have I been on any hikes lately? Yep. Yeah. yeah, I've been on some good hikes. Um Luckily, the last time I went, the water level wasn't too high, so I didn't have to like do some crazy parkour to get across the the creek. But um, yeah, I was feeding some horses. Some people came up, and uh, I let them take some of my food so they could feed them too. And they, they it was kind of funny because they were from Toronto, so they're like they they haven't seen that kind of stuff. First time hiking there, so it was cool to share something with them that like I've seen for you know like half my life, right? So that was really rewarding. So I had a really good hike the last time I went pure chance that those people were just there right at the same time. And I don't even think they saw the horses either. But yeah, I'll put some clips of that in the, the 100k video. Because I wanted to make like a, a thank you for that and then just have some stuff uh, from like my break that I had filmed or photographed just because some cool stuff we saw. Please heal, you're getting anxious. I'm sorry. I. <laughs> oh, wait. I'm still going the opposite way, dude. You have to go left. Keep going left. Getting so lost playing this. I'm sure a lot of people do, though. Because then eventually the direction changes where I don't go left. I have to go somewhere else. But until then... Do you get a special stream on your birthday, Mana Break? If I did that, then I'd have to special stream every day, because every single day of the of the year, someone it's going to be someone's birthday. And I bet you, in this community, there is someone that has a birthday of every day of the year. At, at some point, at, to some extent, or something like that, you know? 
I bet I bet you it would be like the most regrettable thing. <laughs> be like, sure, no problem. Hey, it's my birthday tomorrow. Hey, it's my birthday tomorrow too. Hey, it's my birthday tomorrow as well. Hey, my birthday's the next day. Hey, my birthday's two weeks from now. It's like, uh, well, this is impossible. Oh, all the stuff fell in the water. That sucks. Man, that's hilarious that like we actually went the wrong way twice there. So you have to go all the way down, then you have to go right. Small biscuit, when I say the whole community, I mean everybody that's watched the stream, dude. So like hundreds of thousands of people. Definitely gonna be a birthday for every day, or like pretty close, I think. That the odds of 365 divided by 100,000, that's pretty, or 130 something. Like everybody I've ever seen on the channel is probably gonna be a birthday. For a lot. Uh, how far to 100 100k subs? Ooh, that's a that's a whole another story, man. Only uh, 101k. We're actually at negative. Jeff Bezos got so mad that I uh, didn't slave drive myself 70 hours a week that he uh, he revoked the partnership. So now I got uh, negative subs. I know you are not used to healing, but this is a first playthrough. You can be casual. Oh, dude, honestly, I'm not I'm not trying to like force myself to not heal. I literally just don't even remember that you can do that in time. And then when I realize I forget it takes so long to heal in this. It's, it's really not that I'm trying. I'm not trying to like be fancy or anything. I literally just don't remember. Like I've only played two hours, 20 minutes before this. So and a lot of that was talking to you guys about it while playing. So so I'm still getting like used to even like some of the controls still. Some of the enemies. Uh oh. Still dying, you know. Oh, you figured it was a joke. My bad, my bad. You can be casual. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. Sorry, I, uh... Yeah, no, in, in all legitimacy, though, like, I definitely, for, like, forgot. I didn't even remember. I thought I kept thinking for some reason there's, like, an instant heal item. Because in these there usually is. Or something replenishing, replenishable. Like whenever you die. Well, all right. You can sort of parry those bugs if you hit them right before they hit you. You send them flying the other way. Really? I want to try that. Ah, uh, it didn't work. I didn't press the right button for that. Oh, there we go. That's really interesting. Now are we going up? Is that where my thing is? Oh, you have to be so quick to hit it right before it hits you. Oh, that's scary. Unless it's like above you. Yeah, if it's like coming from like the ceiling, maybe it's a little easier. I'm wasting my ability. Could have healed next time, probably. Yeah, some map guys over here, and then we go down more. This is where we were breaking off the um, the platforms that had the ropes on them. And then I think we got down here, and we couldn't we couldn't continue or something. I can't remember. Note to self: I'm gonna review my last playthrough part on YouTube every single time before I start the next one. If there's like a week between or like days, so I can remember what we were doing. So I know that I know this area was newer, but I feel like there's something we couldn't do. We went here too, right? There's just some dude looking at something, or like a... Oh, it's the cave, yeah. Descend into the belly of the world. Is it pre versus get good fight or after? Oh, this is a pre-get good fight. Okay, so this is a get good fight in the game? Wow. 
I had a feeling there'd be some sort of thing like that, because the, the last boss we fought did not seem that hard. But... What is this thing? Oh, I'm getting life force. Nice. Forgot about those things. Oh, the rock? You mean like the little statues in the background? I don't think they actually give you anything. You can just break a lot of stuff in the background of this game, so I, I usually do. Oh! Ugh. I want. I, I noticed at the last second as I was falling, I should have gone over here to get this one, and then I killed myself by doing that. Damn. All right. Oh, here's the hornet. Interesting. Okay, there's a hidden wall there, and I almost died. Those who stray from the White King's road shall face the law of Un. All right. I couldn't jump. I pressed jump four times there. <laughs> no, I kind of like held the button. <laughs> uh, Bali, what's up? How's it going? You got purged because you linked the soundtrack on Spotify? Oh, um, you have to get a, a, a link permission from one of the moderators to link anything. Sorry, man. Uh, is there a moderator here right now? If not, I can actually permit you myself. I am not going to even play around with that. Let's just continue. Hmm. There's a lot of these things left. Okay, good thing that can't go through walls. That would really frustrate. Okay, that's not good. Should have saw that coming. Oh, I can I can kill this thing too though. Forgot. Oh, they give you a lot of stuff. Enter Hollowness is your favorite track, um, followed by NKG. Have I heard that one yet, or any of those yet, or no? Can't really tell by name. All right, we got a tree monster. Can you hit him? Oh. Shoot the spell when he runs. I was trying to hit him without this. I keep forgetting we have the spell. Oh man. We have like a projectile we can use. Not even using it. Oh, can I make that jump? I don't think I can. Just barely. Oh my god. So close to being able to do that. Destroy the child. Scramlet. Wait, what? Uh, Dix, thank you for the, uh, the good luck. I appreciate it. I'm assuming something crazy is coming up, maybe? Is there a boss? Or just good luck in general? There we go. That is how you play. I think it's good I figured out a way to kill this thing anyways, though, because like it's kind of hard to hit.
Oh, Hornet's there again, too. Definitely has those Mega Man vibes. Like Mega Man and Zero. Can you tell me something shocking, Jay Ventures? As, as long as it is uh, allowed to be spoken about on the website. Um, if not, you can message me, but so I mean, yeah, if it's like appropriate for the stream, sure. So the world might be made. Uh, Anonymous, thank you for gifting Killa sub. I appreciate that. That's very nice. Um, whoever that was. I wonder who it could be. That was a very particular person you picked as well. Which makes me think you might actually own that account and every other account and you might actually just be the same person who is actually me pretending to be other people. For 5% of the audience, it's actually real. The game Titan Souls? Uh, I've heard so Titan Souls before. Be I think I did a giveaway for that, actually. I, I wasn't really a fan of it, though. I've watched a lot of it. I wasn't into it by looking at it. Toll Machine symbol of the bench. Oh, is this to get uh, transportation over here? Shortcut? Nice map updated too. Uh oh. Oh, uh, almost died there. Uh, this is frightening. Oh, it's, okay, I thought he was still moving. It's just his body falling. Ro slowly rolling off. Look at this. Slowly just rolling off. Let strength be granted so uh -oh. the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. I like how when he heals, he's just really concentrated. <laughs> I am just all of you guys, yeah. Uh, you might think you understand what's happening, but that is a blatant lie. You're going to need to watch it. Watch Moss Bag's three hour lore video first. Sorry, come back later. Moss Bag's three hour lore video. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, MCAS, thank you for the 10 months. Welcome back. Double digit month club. That's, that's insane. I remember when you subbed originally. Welcome back, man. Didn't think you'd still be streaming Rumble? Oh, yeah. We're still going, man. We're going to do another uh, hour or so, of the, or hour and a half of this. Wait. Hour 45, roughly. We'll see. We'll see how long it takes, because um, we got to find some new stuff. I kind of want to I want to get to like a boss that actually like makes me not like, you know, win for like four hours, though. Like, that's the is, is this game going to do that? Am I going to get stuck for four hours on something? Uh, it's been a long time since that's happened. That didn't really happen with Code Vein, or um, didn't happen with uh, Mortal Shell as much. Code Vein, there was the one. There's a boss that'll make me stuck for four hours. Okay, cool. The greater mind once dreamed of leaf and cast these caverns so in every bush and every vine, the mind of Un reveals itself to us. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Ooh. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Pantheon. Late game content is really hard. Oh, okay, so like nothing in the early game though. Watchers. Maybe not the base game, but the DLC will kick your shit in. Okay. I might have to get the DLC for this then. Uh, 
Uh, I can't get up here. Oh, you know what? We need to break another one of these from above, don't we? Or probably need an ability or something. We could go up the other way. Oh, DLC's included by, by default. I didn't know that. Cool. What charms do I have on right now? I have, um, let's see, the uh, Wayward Compass and Soul Catcher. Oh, I didn't put Soul Catcher on. I should have done that. Well, up here there's nothing. Um, yeah, next time we have a bench. Gotta go this way still, too. Oh. That's not a boss, is it? Doesn't seem like it. getting real. I got so greedy. Oh. Okay, I'm not even paying attention, really. Almost screwed up there a little bit. Oh no, I'm gonna get killed by a plant after I almost had a cool battle with that guy. I had what would, what would be considered a, a face off and then just get, gets killed by a plant. A little bush guy. <laughs> Game's over, you beat it, that's it. Just had to beat that guy, that's it. Uh, where are we now? Oh, that's kind of weird. We're like right between the line of two areas, it seems. Or... Oh no, we're literally... yeah. Hmm. Seems like a new place. We could also go this way too. Uh, or can we? No, we can't. Unless we go up here first. Kind of want to see what's going on up here. Forgotten how good this game looks. I, one thing I noticed too is the colors pop a lot more because I'm using the GPU encoding. And this game has some really cool colors in it. So I think it makes it even nicer. And it's 2D. So it's like really easy to make sharp on, the, on OBS. So... Yeah, I, I noticed that too. And I think I think that helps. I'm trying to think of like where else. Ah, that's not good. How do you get across there? You probably have to dash, right? Yeah, you need like a late jump. You, you need double jump for that. So we'll come back there later, I guess. Where is this again? I want I want to remember. Oh, we don't have the map for this area. So this is like to the right of um the green area. That place looks scary. See, so yeah, at green path. To the right of green path, we gotta come back later when we have double jump. 
Uh oh. Damn it. The struggle. Uh, there we go. Oh my god, he dropped a lot of stuff. Wow. <laughs> that was a crazy payout for that. Just what do you think you're doing? You dare to come between me and my prey. Is it a habit of yours to scurry about getting in the way and causing bother? Now this, Kerr, I am Zo the Mighty. Who's Kerr? What does that mean? A knight of great renown. Cross me again and you will find why they call my weapon Life Ender. <laughs> That's pretty funny. He basically, he basically is, he's just like old, old Hollow Knight. That's pretty much it. Kerr is an insult. Oh, I see. Zote's the best character. He's like old Hollow Knight, man. He's like he's like the sensei. He looks exactly the same. Just one antler's bigger and or horn and got the eye bags. Is it my first time playing this, um, Sir Ghost? It is, yes. Ah, uh, wait, what? Where's this? This must be a place we, no, maybe it's not a place we've been to. The green children walked from the dream unto these lands. Here we now shall wait, patient for the call to return. Okay. They're waiting for something. Forgot how much you love the the game. Enjoy. I enjoyed watching it quite a bit. I must say it's definitely more fun playing it, so I'm glad I did. Oh, this guy's extra tryhard here. I should, have, I should have healed. I bet you someone the entire time was like, you should heal, and then I didn't. Damn. Oh wait, let's let's put our thing on at least while we rest. Uh this one. There we go. You all thought that yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was bad. 
Closer to where I was, but not quite. Am I in the same place? I'm like above this place. Yeah, this is the place I couldn't get to, so I had to go up. And then... This isn't where we died, no. It's the other guy. Only Estus run one. Only Estus. So you have to throw the flask at people or use like the glass shards to cut them. <laughs> Even after you play this game for so long, the shieldy guys are still annoying. They're pretty fast. I noticed that. Um, so this is a dead end too. Then where'd we go? Yeah, because that was a no-go. We had to go right. I guess we have to kill the shield guy again. <laughs> look, like, look at him freak out when I walk by. He, like, the tracking is so precise, like, for the, for the blocking. Do for the other one. Uh oh. Looks like Dark Souls PvP, kind of. That is very true. where Zo was, right? Or no, that's where the Hornet was. Oh, yeah, the Hornet was Zo. Sorry, my bad. Then this turns into here, and then we go down. And hopefully I find my soul over here. Land on the guy's head. Already dying. like parried him by attacking at the same time right there. That was weird. Does that happen? Oh, that's interesting. Wow. So you literally parry by attacking at the same time. Okay, that's not good. stuff nice and then look at all these it's raining is there any point in pairing I don't really think there is it doesn't really seem there's like a counter maneuver or anything it's kind of just you just hit them at the same time and it won't do anything to you so at the very least if you're randomly attacking you might just have a situation or even normally you might get lucky oh stay out of there Oh yeah, we gotta go down still, right? 
Uh, Gabby Rose, what's up? How's it going? Pairing is hard in this game. Yeah, it kind of doesn't really seem like you'd use it the way that you would parry normally. Oh, we can go down, too. Oh, there's my thing. There's this guy. I just have a bunch of them over here. Yay. <laughs> I've gotten so many of those. I'm doing pretty good, Gabby. Thank you for asking. Uh, DS1 parry is the easiest. You don't even have to face the attack. DS1 parrying is really easy compared to some other ones, for sure. I mean, like, it's not easy to do in general, but it's, it's easier to do than some of the parries that you can compare. Oh, I see an arrow pointing down. And then this, okay, wait, we can go over here. And then finally access the transportation, right? Or, oh, she has a pretty cool voice. Come no closer, ghosts. I've seen you creeping through the undergrowth, stalking me. <laughs> this old kingdom, a terrible thing awakens. I can smell it in the air. I know what you are. I know what you try to do. I can't allow it. Oh! Now we have to fight the protagonist of the sequel, dude? Come on. It's probably gonna be one of those ones where you don't, you don't actually beat them, obviously. They're not dead, right? See, healing was what actually screwed me up. Not healing made me focus. videos on YouTube for months wanted to show some love. Also, what's your favorite band? Oh, I keep forgetting. Oh, she, she'll just, just like a regular attack? Why? Why? <laughs> Dude, panic button. Yo, you, thank you so much for doing that, man. That's crazy. Been watching your videos on YouTube for months. Wanted to show you some love. Also, what's your favorite band? Oh, that's, that's very nice of you, man. Um, thank you. Favorite band? Um, that's hard to say. I, I don't really have a, like one single favorite band. There's so much music I know of that it wouldn't even... Like, I would be lying to myself if I even had a favorite. Just, there's just not really a way. There's too much stuff. Um... But, um, I'm trying to think of like what I've listened to the most lately, um, in terms of bands, uh, it's like there are any albums, I'm trying to think, I don't even think there's even been some albums I've listened to, I've been listening to a lot of different musics, I mean, 
Not even particularly bands at all, just like a bunch of different stuff. So I don't know. Do I like Periphery? I do, but I don't like their new album. So I mean, like, they're not really like keeping my attention anymore. But I mean, they might do something in the future that's cool. Their old stuff's good. Um, or older stuff. Like the third album was really nice. Uh, but yeah, a lot of the a lot of the bands I used to like, like eventually someone makes an album I don't like, and then I stop listening to them. In terms of like even their old stuff too, like I just don't really play it as much. Now I'll come back to it here and there, but I'm trying to think of like new albums. The only new album I've heard recently that was good was Logic's new album, and then um, like everything else that I'd caught up on was probably already old. Like it wasn't even really even even that's kind of old too. Like at this point. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm sorry to disappoint you for that. Like, what, what's your favorite band though? band is a rubber band <laughs> lately the only new stuff you're listening to is black metal okay i see what are what are even I, I can't even name a black metal band other than like maybe no even I, can, I can't i actually don't think i can even name a black metal band i don't really know what constitutes that like i don't, I don't know i i know po what constitutes power thrash and like other like core and like prog and all that but not not black metal though Sabaton? Sabaton's, I thought Sabaton was power metal, though. That's what I was told. So is power metal black metal or something, or is that different? Black metal's like Emperor? Nova, what's up? How's it going? Also, Panic Button, dude, thank you so much for the brand new sub as well. I appreciate that. Sorry, I'm kind of like derping out right now on where to go. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to go through a bunch of stuff again. Gonna have to fall. Oh, I... I to get all the way over there, actually, it's going to take a while, I think. So we have to go up through here. I don't know if we can kill this guy, or skip this guy. I guess we could. So we don't have to kill these guys. Uh, Gorgoroth? I don't think I've heard of Gorgoroth. Sabaton is history metal. Okay. Am I ready to spend 100 hours on this game? Uh, I think so. We're not really going to be like grinding it hard. Like I'll probably be playing it... Uh, a couple times a week at least for until I beat it. So I'm not I'm not like rushing it too much. But I figured this would be probably a good fifty to hundred hours or so. Unless of course like you're just saying like getting all the stuff in the game and in that case I don't know if I'm gonna get everything, but just to do like a playthrough, I think we can get in like I even like thirty to fifty hours to be Pretty impressive for me. These kinds of games. Typical power metal, but they uh, swap dragons for tanks. Okay. I see. You'd say either Polyphia or Nirvana, really. That's a pretty close uh, comparison, wow. Or, or sorry, that, that's a, that's a, or those are pretty different things, but that's like a, that's an interesting comparison for the two close, the closest ones. Very, very different things. Yesterday was my birthday. Here is a sub. Um, current, no, thank you so much for the six months. Welcome back. You shouldn't be giving me a sub for your birthday. Th happy late birthday, first of all. Oh, there's the shortcut I missed before. Now we can get over here. Yeah, thank you so much, Karen. Welcome back. I hope you enjoy your brand new badge as well. You have 50, 56 hours and 19 minutes for your first playthrough, Dronzi. I think that's pretty standard for this game, right? Like, what is a long first playthrough, even? 105% in 51 hours? I don't know if I'm going to do the over percent on it, or... 
more than what's normally in it. Maybe maybe we will though by the time we Oh here we go. Got the shortcut this time. And then I just <laughs> got the shortcut so I could die like really fast. <laughs> oh boy, that's funny. Okay, um <laughs> At least it was a quick one. Quick and painless. Oh my god, even that thing's denying me over here? Nice. Can't even play. Don't even have any power left either. Look how crazy the lights become when you are about to die. I didn't even realize. That's interesting. I love I love when there's like cool visual effects for uh, like near near death. Especially if they're not black and white, you know. <laughs> Or just like red. Twelve percent is the DLC. Oh, okay. I thought the DLC would just be part of the hundred percent, and then you'd get extra items to. I guess that doesn't make any sense, though. You're right. Yeah, it should be the DLC is the extra stuff. My shell is leaking. <laughs> Normally it's black and white or all red tint, which you hate. Yeah, I really, I'm not a fan of those. But when it does like something brighter, it makes you, like it, it makes it like a filtered uh, color scheme or whatever. And it looks nice. That's that's a cool feature. It's like motivation to hang on for a second there. Uh, you love this game? How you been enjoying it? I like it a lot too, man. It's a beautiful game. It's, it's actually... Um, even like I, I thought it was gonna be good to play it because I've seen it, but it was it's even cooler than I thought because there's this area with all this color in it that I don't think I even have seen when I was watching people do playthroughs. So I, I really like the art direction. Yeah, like it almost makes me want to draw the game. To be honest, I did some Cuphead stuff, so maybe maybe I'll draw Hollow Knight or like a Hollow Knight scene. Just for fun. Is drawing a hobby years. I used to want to be an artist before I started playing music, so I was doing a uh, doing a lot of sketching. I started getting into sculpting actually at one point too, and then I did um, acrylics like later on, like years ago. You guys saw some acrylic stuff that I did. Um, but yeah, like it's it's like one of those things I can do. I definitely know I can get a lot better at it if I practice it again. But I did used to always be doing art, so and I've still done some of my own for the channel, like in the meantime, but nothing crazy though. Um, but yeah, like doing a Hollow Knight drawing would be sick. Cause I did a Cuphead one that was pretty, pretty decent. Definitely can't really go wrong with the super cartoony stuff, you know. Why don't you fill your energy on mobs before the fight? I should. I was, I was just trying to get there. Sometimes I get impatient. <laughs> if you go down, there's a bench. Uh, oh, from where we were, around this area. Yeah, I was gonna say we haven't checked out where the what goes what goes down. Let's do that. Cause it shows like right there on the sign, right? There we go. And that takes us to there. Do you have to call the thing here? Uh, I'm not going to do it yet. Check out the new Ori game, Warhawk. Um, so I played the first one. I might I might check out the second one at some point. I just hadn't really got to it when it came out. You've seen that sign before. You should have known what it means. Uh, I d dude, d d <laughs> 
you, you're, you're talking to me. I don't know anything. Dude, I will not pay attention to the most obvious stuff, dude, because my brain's not thinking about that kind of stuff. I, my, my mind doesn't work that way. There's no chance I'll know what that sign does. If I sit up, sit and think about it a little bit, maybe, but, you know, if we're not thinking about it, then of course I'm not going to know. You, you can't, you can't like, watch me play this and then think, compare it to yourself. Like, I'm not going to think of it the things this, the way you will. And I'm, like, I'm, like, pretty stupid in a lot of ways. I mean, in that way, you're not going to get any luck at all. But in other ways, I might, might have the upper hand on you. Though I will say, I mean, it does it does help us get back there a little quicker. It's not like a crazy, crazy difference. So luckily, we still had a quick way to get back here. It's nice to have the shortcuts, though. Yeah. I hate the... When she throws the... Um, no. The weapon, that's crazy. Nice. I guess you want to be close. Oh, I did, she did it twice. Okay. Damn. Is, is this a Souls-like game? I don't really know. I don't know if I would call it that. Maybe. Uh, Mariola confirmed. Thank you very much for the brand new sub. I hope you enjoy your emotes. Welcome. How long have I been playing for Hollow Knight for today? Uh, we've been on it for about an hour and 20 minutes or so. I think. Am I a fan of Nas? Nas is a really good rapper, yeah. If that's who you're talking about. I am. Um, he's definitely one of like the better... Like I, I guess he's not like old school technically. Well, I mean, he's not as old school as some people, but he's like a little bit older school to me. So like... Um, definitely can't go wrong with Nas. I haven't listened to anything from him for a while, though. I'm getting two frantics. Oh god. The bop on the head is so funny. I'm trying to get used to that. Okay, sir, I was kind of screwing around with the bop on the head. Benches work a bit like bonfires as well. Yeah, they do. Why is Cornerfer's humming the best? Cornerfer is the map maker, right? He, he actually does have some pretty good humming. He does seem like the... It, it, it's almost like they picked a voice for each character that really does fit, even though it's not even realistic at all, you know, or based on anything that makes sense. Like, just based on, like, how the characters look, they definitely have, uh, fitting... fitting voices. Some are still really funny, though. I shouldn't have done the bounce.
And of course she escapes. You know what it is? It gives me the Mega Man and Zero vibes and Metroid Fusion and like the Imposter Samus kind of same sort of thing. Obviously this this character is a good character, not the enemy, but same sort of deal there. Taken Mothwing Cloak. Press RT dash forwards. Use the cloak to dash quickly along the ground or through the air. Nice. Would it seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. Boom. <laughs> this is where the real game starts. Oh no. Hey, I uh, hope you don't mind. I'm just uh, just kicking a bunch of grass in your face. Oh, you can't breathe. I'm sorry. Uh, let me move over. Okay, sorry, man. My bad. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Is he dead? So the world might be mended. What happened? Why? Uh, Death God, thank you so much for the, the Prime sub for 22 months. I appreciate that, man. Welcome back. Apparently, you can dash over all the gaps now. That's nice. Um, so even if we don't have double jump, we can go to that area that we were looking into before, right? Or, hmm. Hmm, let me see. Well, we can still go, we can still go down in this area and then go left go up there's a lot of places we can go in this place um let's actually just check out this over here oh oops let's not fall in the water all the peaceful music is gone too now or can we not get back up like oh i was i was above never mind ah it's like just enough distance Okay, so you kind of needed to do that to get out to this area anyways. Lake of Un. Oh, we found it. Who's this guy? Oh, hello there. Seems we both tread far from the path. Can hardly believe those dusty old highways led to such a lush and lively place. This building suggests some form of worship, uh, though its idol has clearly been long forgotten. Doubles equally well for a moment's respite. I saw a strange fellow out there. He seemed... Oh, shit, I didn't see that second part. He seemed quite something that we don't know. <laughs> I pl uh, I planned to offer greetings, though I figured uh, I'd first tend to my nail on the chance our meeting goes poorly. Oh, so he's he's getting ready for battle in case uh, I I decide to kill him. Your nail looks like a fine instrument, but it's showing signs of wear. I'd wager up there it would take you far. I'd wager up there it would take you far. Down here, however, I suspect you'll soon meet dangers to the surface. The surface world cannot match. How Ness is perfect for vigilant explorers like us, so tense and thrilling. In this place, you're either alert or you're dead. Hmm. Alrighty. Quite taken by the lake. Okay, my bad. Thank you for mentioning that. I was confused for a second. I three to see you play through this, but got to go. Ill watch the bod latest I has. Uh, Kelmeister, thank you so much for the, the bits. I appreciate it, man. I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed it. I'm going to be putting the second part of this, like I said... Uh, on YouTube. I just want to like, combine it with the next stream that we do of it, unless it's like a really big one. I'm thinking we'll probably do like a, another two or three hour, uh, you know, and end the stream kind of with it and then combine this and that next one together. So that'll probably be either tomorrow or Tuesday. But yeah, we got, we got to start practicing Mortal Shell for the tournament too. So I'm going to do a shellless run on that. 
and uh, practice my speed on it a bit. Oh, I shouldn't have. Why am I standing there? Not even thinking. It's probably way easier to just do this. Oh, he can block his head. That's wild. He actually blocked above his head. This game is really good. And then he disappeared. This game's really bad. Oh, never mind. Just joking. Uh-oh. Oh! Get him. Ya yeet. Do you have the DLCs? Apparently the DLC comes with this. Or at least one of them does. Um, I'm trying to think of... Uh, yeah, we have the apparently the map for this, which is just an extension of this area. So once we get, um, I'm assuming other items, or we come back here later, maybe this guy can help us. Hmm. Or maybe we'll, we'll see him again. I don't know. I, I thought he was a blacksmith or something like that. Um, or we can jump in. That didn't work. Uh, all the DLCs do, you'll just probably miss how how to activate them. All the DLCs do, just you will probably miss how to activate them. Um, so all the DLCs come with the game, but you can kind of like miss getting into them, kind of like Dark Souls, I'm assuming. That's what you're trying to say. Well, what I'll do is like when I know I've beaten the game or gotten close, if you guys, if you guys even know, you can tell me uh, how to get into the DLCs and we'll do it if I, if I haven't found them already because that's pretty much the only way we're going to... Like, I mean, instead of me, like, walking around forever trying to figure out how to access the DLC when we've beaten the game, that would be kind of lame. So the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Nice to see that you play Hollow Knight. Do you enjoy it so far? Uh, Azralos, yeah, this game's really cool, man. I have enjoyed it so far. I, I knew I would, too. It was mainly just I had seen the game before, so I didn't really want to spoil... Or I didn't want to play a game I'd spoiled for myself, but really, it's not a big deal. Um... Why is squad mode still on? It shouldn't be, but I can fix it though. I thought once everybody left, it would be fine. When we were doing the squad stream, give me a second. There we go. Sorry about that. Cool. Nice, now we can make it up here. And this is just a shortcut. So I guess like the meta now is just run through the game with the dash. <laughs> is that what it becomes? How much game time do I have on this? Uh, so far, probably like three and a half hours or so. I would guess by the time we're done today, it'll be about four hours on the game. Just over four hours, maybe. But I can I can check when we finish. We'll make a note of that. It's actually too good for 2D, you wish, uh, it's too good for 2D, like you wish it was a 3D game. <laughs> wish you a great time and no hints from chat. I mean, people are giving tips here and there, but it's not a big deal, though. The joy is of backtracking, yeah, the backtracking in this is kind of like Metroid and Castlevania and all that. Mega Man, you don't pack backtrack in. Mega Man's the one game you don't, but Metroid, yes. So much backtracking in Metroid, oh my god. So I'm, I'm used to it, it's not a big deal. I do like that game. Okay, I kind of was healing at the same time as he blew me up when I was looking at chat not paying attention. Yay. Ah, uh, Sherad, what's up, man? Yeah, I do love this game. It's good. It's very good. I would actually, I would rank it pretty high already just from what I played out of every indie game I played that's like this. Even just indie games in general. It's, it's definitely up there. Uh, Final Fate, what's up? Makes you want to revisit Hollow Knight. 
Uh, Rain, well, I mean, it might be a good time, too, because the second one's going to come out, so maybe when you figure out the date for that, you can kind of play through the first one right before it comes out. Do them back-to-back. -back. That's what I'm going to... Um, hopefully, I can do something with this game right before it comes out. That's the that's the, the goal, is, like, maybe we'll play, like, up the stuff... We'll finish up the stuff we haven't finished, or we'll do a run of it again right before that. Um, if not, though, hopefully this is cool. So I was thinking that the, the second one would come out really soon and that we would actually be able to time the first playthrough, but I don't think we're going to be able to. It's not really a known thing right now. When it now releases. Top five, five, five favorite games. I can't even speak. Uh, Sekiro, DS3... Or, sorry. Uh, Sekiro, Bloodborne, DS3, DS1, DS2. That's the order. Well, there's a plant right there, too. Like, the way that the visuals and the sound really influences, like, the vibe of the game is crazy, man. Like, it has a lot of atmosphere because of that. Even, even when you go to get your uh, your life back, right? Or your, your soul. It, it kind of makes it spooky. I did Pantheon of Hallow Nest a few weeks ago. You're happy to finally smack the moth. Is the moth the hardest thing? Is this hard game, as they say? Is the game hard? Uh, so far, not like I wouldn't. I wouldn't say it's giving me that hard of a time so far. But apparently, we were just doing like the beginning stuff, so we're not really at the point where it gets hard. But I would imagine it turns into quite a ridiculous situation because I've seen some stuff from people that are actually really good at it, and uh, it, it, it does seem very hard with the DLC. So that opens up. All right. And now we can finally go down that path, <laughs> wherever that is. Did Sekiro give me a hard time? Uh, the ending of Sekiro gave me a very hard time, and some of the areas destroyed me. Not not every single thing on the game, but some things definitely destroyed me on it. So I would say yes. And I think this is going to be the same kind of case, just uh, it'll, it'll get harder as we go. Uh, what's the last boss you beat? I did the Hornet. Which I'm assuming was the get good. Is, is wait, is the Hornet the get good boss, or is that still yet to come? Because I have, I actually have no idea. How do you heal? You have to hold down B, and then you get, um, you get this little uh, orb that fills in the corner, and then when that fills, you can use special attacks. But you can also use that to heal if you want to as well. If you just hold the the button. All right. Horn is the first skill barrier, but not the get good boss. Okay. Yeah, I was curious about that. Yeah, the soundtrack's amazing, dude. I don't actually think I've heard a soundtrack this good in a long time. Like this actually probably is one of the best game soundtracks I've heard. And I've been told that before, I just hadn't really given it like a really close listen. So I'm going to download that. We definitely need to add it to the Spotify. Oh, this thing looks really scary. Uh, good thing I had two of those. Okay, I can't make it there. I literally have to fly. So that's not going to be possible. Uh, 
Uh, that means we can continue just going this way and then go up if we want to. Oh, that, that hurts me too. Wait, what? But it put me through there though. So to get back out of there, you have to get hurt? Is that what just happened? Like to go through here? I didn't, oh, I didn't go this way before, okay. Hmm, I must need some sort of thing to like get through there safely. I thought I, hmm, I thought I went through part of that area. Cause I've been here. And then from here we have to go to the right. Wait, can I whack this thing a second time, do you think? No. So you only get like three little bits of energy from it. Is there any new mod for DS3? Uh, there's an Ascension mode one that's like basically super, super hard. Uh, that's the newest thing I've heard of so far. And then like Cinder's mod keeps getting updated all the time. So yeah, we'll probably, I think the first thing I'll do back on that before we actually even get into um, the Pyromancy run again will probably be Ascended mod because that's been requested for a long time too. And then we gotta do Sekiro Randomizer still because I missed out on that. Oh boy. This is all the way back from where we came basically. Oh wait, we missed, wait, where was the place where we could go up? I missed it. There's some area where you can go up. Way over here. Oh, and then I died. Yay. What about no damage DS2? I still want to do that. I just it's one of those things where um that's a crazy, crazy big run, and there's no there's no way that I'm gonna be able to do that run. Um even if that's all I put my time into, there's it's still not even gonna happen for a while, for months. So like I'm not super worried about that right now. Um I kind of want to get a lot of the um, other stuff that I've been wanting to do for a long time out of the way first, and then we can get into more new stuff and then do that at the same time. Because I have, I have like the plans for it, um, like the notes. It's like 10 hours of notes and then uh, one hour of save files out of the 10 hours, so just have to continue that. But I'll be fair, it's not really fun doing that. Like, like it's a fun run when you do it, but it's not a fun thing to prepare for, so. Uh, I don't want to stress myself out with that right now, given that I'm still going to have to stream and then do that. Like, I don't want that to be my free time. So, we'll make it part of the stream time when uh, it's right. Oh, God. Don't die again, yeah. I... <laughs> I've had some scenarios on this. I'm just trying to think if we fall down right away. We're gonna have to get our shadow again and then go all the way back, okay. <laughs> I wanna figure out what way, I, well, I'm basically trying to figure out any single part on the map that has an entrance we haven't gone to and just check it out. Sister Frida took you a long time. Sister Frida's pretty hard. Definitely don't blame you on that one. That's a... That's a rage boss. I think that took me about five hours or something like that. Probably would have been more if I got really mad at it. Uh-oh. All right, let me fall down here. Lawrence took you forever. Lawrence is like one of the hardest things, definitely. I, I can I can totally agree with that one. I think though, Lawrence, I, I did on New Game Plus for some reason. I didn't do it the first time I did the DLC. I, it was like the second time around.
Wait, so we have to go up here? Is there some hidden thing in the ceiling? Or I'm like right beside it? No, it's right here. My bad. Oops. No damage Hollow Knight run. Has ever anybody even done that? I, it has been done before, yeah. Oh, I'm, st I'm still taking damage over here. Jeez. What's that about? That does not look friendly. Or, or safe. Before death right here on this guy. Yep, he, he charged me. He did it. Two masks left. If you look at the map, you can find unexplored areas at the holes or the holes of different areas. Hmm. Hole. What do you mean by holes of different areas? Probably get your souls back first. I didn't really even have that many, did I? Wait, can you actually enter? You can enter there by pushing down on the regular thumbstick, not the D-pad. That's weird. Just wondering how I entered that without trying to enter. <laughs> it's like trying to walk away. 600 Geo gone, damn. In the shop, though, like, I haven't really seen anything that's super useful. Like, that I don't already have. Like, maybe, maybe there is now, but the only shop I found, the map uh, guy's wife, like, it wasn't really that great. Maybe that changes, though. Alright, we're doing that again. 800 is, is many at this stage? Damn. Mod with three times enemies. It's hard mod. You play, I think. Play at eight hours. I have done three times enemies mod before, yeah. That's one of the things we did. We went all the way back here. Wow. I'm planning to 100% Hollow Knight. Uh, I do, I do want to try the DLC for it if we're gonna play the game. It'd be cool to try that. So maybe what I'll do is I'll beat the game and I'll save the DLC right before the uh, the second game comes out. That's probably gonna be the plan. And then we have something really exciting to get into right before. And then we we're already like right ahead of everyone else that's gonna replay this or play it for the first time to prepare for the second one that are variety streamers because we'll be doing like the DLC immediately. And then if I like it, I can even do like mini runs, the DLC or the game or something, if, if I really care that much. But in terms of timing and everything, I think it'll be really good to save the DLC. Not that I really want to, but um, better than playing it again, having known what it is. And then like people are just like, okay, you're just like replaying it. You already know the game. You're not doing a run, so it's not that impressive, right? Um, okay, I think we're going to go all the way down. DLC takes 20 hours. That's perfect, man. I think we want this bench. There's still a lot of cool optional stuff aside from the DLC, including a lot of boss fights. That's awesome, man. I thought that like everything would be like mandatory on this. In terms of boss fights, at least. So the world might be mended. Uh, Lamora, thank you so much for the 52 months, man. Welcome back. That is a crazy reset, dude. How are you doing? I don't know if you're you're around in time for Fall Guys. I was calling. I was uh, mentioning you earlier. We played with. Uh, some some people from chat and then uh or they were watching the squad stream and then we did uh some with k witty and frost as well and and strawberry as well or or t t how do you even say the name to yeah. to get something like that i just see the spelling of this name so i can actually pronounce it yeah. oh shit there we go Oh, no, no, never mind. Rip. Let's see. 
That was still over there. No spoilers, but you already missed a boss fight. Wow. Your actual name is Tove. Okay. Like T O V. Is that how you say that? Tove? Or Tove? Uh, Val Jaren, what's up, man? You got sick last night and you overslept real bad. Oh, don't even apologize. If you're sick, don't even don't even apologize, man. I would not even worry. Make sure you get some rest. Elden Ring is a myth. <laughs> you probably need to f need chat to find a lot of things in this game. <laughs> I guess we'll see. So far, the only thing that I noticed really was someone pointed out the, uh, like at least today, someone pointed out that there was a bench, or the sign meant that there was a bench below or whatever. And I mean, like thinking enough about it, I probably could have put that together. But I also. It didn't really give me a like, crazy advantage, so it wasn't something that like I really care about. But I do, I do prefer when people don't spoil things as much. That'd be nice. So, unless I really ask for the help, and I and I'm not talking to myself, which I should probably stop doing with questions because then you wouldn't get confused. Yeah, this guy rolled off. That is really scary. This is the guy that got me. Have I seen the Elden Ring subreddit? I don't go on Reddit, so no. Uh, I've heard things in chat about the subreddit of it. Oh, shit. I thought I was going to die of fall damage again. There might be something interesting in the platforming area you've seen before. Is that supposed to be a spoiler? <laughs> there could be something that you haven't found yet in a game you've never played. Am I done with Mortal Shell? No, we're going to be playing it tomorrow. Uh, i got to get practice for the tournament. Coming up, we're going to be doing a uh, Deathless tournament um, in cooperation with the devs and some, some other... Possibly other sponsors. I'm not exactly sure if we have like more than one sponsor for it or if it's just them and some other people, but... Um, yeah, we'll be, we'll be running a tournament of it. Uh, I'll have more information on that. And yeah, we got to practice for it. So I need to get the game beaten in about 45 minutes, Deathless, uh, and also a no-shell run if, if we could do that. That'd be nice. That's the, that's the first goal. Then we'll, then we'll work on getting it quicker than 45 if we can. Getting to 45 minutes would be really so nice, though. Because it seems like that's going to be the standard. So the world might be mended. Welcome back and enjoy this game. Wow, I can't jump up there. Stay Plus, dude, thank you so much for the, the 45 months. If you, if you guys don't know, Stay Plus is actually a Hollow Knight streamer, or was, at least. And set records and, like, basically, like, help the speedrunning community on it and everything it was a pretty big part of it so you guys know stay plus you probably should watch his like go on youtube and watch his hollow knight runs definitely he's done some pretty crazy ones how have you been man i haven't seen you for a while i'm sure this is probably pretty cool that i'm playing this because i know that's like one of your favorite games right All your runs have gone gone though because your glitch category was deprecated. Oh, okay, I see. You ever you ever thought of running glitchless on this? Can I jump up there? Nope. I think the Hornets are my least favorite enemies, or those like little dudes. Actually, wait, let's refer to them accurately with our trusty journal. It was precisely the Vengefly. Okay, there we go. I love how you can do that. 
Uh, are we are we wanting to go to Forgotten Crossroads? I don't feel like we are supposed to. No, there's still more areas to go. Wait, what is happening in this map? Are we supposed to go down even more? Juan, what's up, dude? How's it going? I feel like I'm supposed to be going down even more. Or no, you know what? Let's go back to where we were before and see if we can double jump, or not double jump, but clear any gaps in the other area. Why not? We'll take the bench right here. The theme of the game is to go deeper. That's what, yeah, that's what I heard from the uh, the uh, the bits of lore that we've uh, read so far. So we're trying to go further into the the core of this this crazy place. Kind of does seem like a descent because you're basically going underground from the beginning, right? But there might be something in this area that we couldn't have accessed, though. I just, I want to see. There's a gun mod for Hollow Knight? Really? Are you serious? That's awesome, man. The reskin mods? What kind of reskins are there? When I ask a question, is it rhetorical? A lot of the time I'm just talking to myself and I'm sorry. I probably shouldn't do that. Uh, I'll try to make it a little more obvious if I actually ask for help. That wasn't timed that well. Uh, oh, that was a left attack or a right attack. Sure do like exploring Hallow Nest with your trusty AK-47. <laughs> sounds so silly. Is that a Hollow Knight emote arm knock? Who, who actually uh, owns that one? It's pretty cool. Did not want to do that. <laughs> Oh, nice. All right, so this was somewhere I remember we came to before. And there was something where I'm pretty sure we either couldn't clear a gap or jump high enough, so. Let's see if that's still over here. I think it was all the way to the right. Oh, it's a barba mode. That's awesome, dude. Nice. Yeah, it's the Havel guy. Was there anything past him, though? Oh, there isn't, though. It's a corner. I should have known that. You can see, you can even see it in the map. Randomizers? Wait, are, is there a randomizer for this game? Stay plus? One was a streamer seeking to conquer without healing. Once embraced, enveloped by the abyss, he found healing and brought ruin to his enemies. Fear not the dark, my friend. Uh, Sarah, thank you very much for the bits. Uh, one was a streamer seeking to conquer without healing. One once embraced, enveloped by the abyss. He found healing and brought... Ruin to his enemies, fear not the dark, my friend, and let the feast begin. That That's uh, from this, right? Or is that from... That was from something we played. I've heard that before. Sorry, my brain's like terrible with that stuff. He had rando races? I didn't get... I don't think I got to see that. Bury the knight with her broken nail. Bury the priest. Something about a crown. I can't remember the rest of that one. Ha ha ha. Maybe I'll just hum it. 
I'm gonna help you out. Let's let's just break some rocks, man. Are you still running about? Why not join me down here? There's plenty of wealth in these rocks. I was just trying to help you out. I wasn't running away. Come on. I was working just as hard on this rock as you were right here. <laughs> Those crystals out there are worth a fair bit. Or a fair bit. But I have a feeling that there is something even more valuable hidden just a bit deeper in. Can almost smell it. Uh, you're welcome to join me. There's enough for both of us. Or if you don't feel like a d -d 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 digging, you can just sit and sing with me. Ha ha ha. Alright. Well, I feel like going up here. Have I played Cuphead on stream? And if not, are you going to? I already beat Cuphead on stream. I'm, I'm going to play it again, though. Why is that happening? I'm assuming you have to break that. Maybe I'll find out later, damn. Hmm, I wonder what that is, yeah. I wonder what that could be. I, I guess that's the only real way up here to go, though. Because, like, that's a dead end, too. Oh, wait get off in between hmm bury the night with her okay she's singing that again come up some, with some songs of their own. Oh, man. That's funny. Yeah, we probably should go lower. Next lower path on the map would probably be the next place to go. Because we were far away from where we were before. Take chip damage from hardening on NG+. Plus. You didn't know that? I've never even heard of that before. Because when we played NG+, Plus, I didn't really pay attention to that. I just played for like the first... Uh, couple minutes or whatever just to see what the the big Zweihander weapon was like how come you can't oh that's probably gonna be unlocked from the other side right I bet all right so this whole part of the game seems like it's not supposed to be revisited yet um Let's keep going down. What was over here? Uh, Rico, what's up? How's it going? I remember what was over here. Oh, you can't get in here yet. I forgot. My bad. So this is something that we're going to have to activate from somewhere else. Um, is there a way to return? To like where you were. Do I have an item? Hmm. <laughs> An elevator, but it wouldn't open. Yeah, that probably would have been a good idea. All right, I kind of feel bad because I think that you you guys definitely knew I was going the wrong way the entire time. That's. And I had a feeling there was like a 50% chance I was going the wrong way based on what I remembered from this area, so. Because there probably is somewhere else we could actually go right now because there's a boss I missed apparently, but I wonder where that is. Let's see. Move faster if you're dashing constantly. I noticed that, but... 
I wasn't sure if that was actually like necessary to do on a first playthrough. Oh my god. I probably should though. I'm not a huge fan of like playing games where you have to be like doing that constantly. Permission to give hints. Um Wait, we should probably go back up, I guess. Uh I think I can get back up there. I mean you can you can give me hints if you want, if they're things that like I missed that are already like it's like something that's too late and I'll I'll have to play again the next time to figure it out, but if it's something that's yet to be yet to be seen, then I kinda wanna do it myself. Getting lost is part of the gameplay? I know, I know. I just feel boring during that. Uh, ben, thank you so much for the host, man. How was your stream? What's up? Okay. Going here. If you guys don't know Ben Rice, he is probably the strongest person with the best singing voice and Let's the cutest cat so the world might be mended. on the planet. So the world might be men. And Good also can play piano. Back, so hope you are enjoying the game. Uh, yeah, Ben, it's good to see you too, man. Actually, so there's a question I have for you. I don't know if Faraz sent you um, a thing regarding the whole situation or not, but uh, yeah, like if not, um, give me a message if you if you can. Just remind me that I gotta tell you something so I don't forget, because I, I need to tell you about it um, and ask you if you want to be a part of it. But uh, thank you for the, the 22 months. Welcome back. Yeah, there's like a little surprise we were trying to plan that we wanted you to be a part of at some point if you can. Oh, now I'm like out of the map. Since I'm playing Hollow Knight, I can finally read your username properly. Bop Nada. Yeah, I called you I called you Bapanda or something like that. Or, or something crazy. And people kept saying it's not that. Oh shit. Anyways, Bob Nada, welcome back. Hopefully you're excited to see this. I know it's like one of your one of your favorite games if your name is literally a reference. Gotta be. Banana. That's really good music, Frank or Z. I think it's probably one of the best soundtracks I've heard. Literally. Even the boss music's good too. Oh god. And someone was saying it's only three people that made the soundtrack and they were just like, you know, working that like how, how like how long have they even been composing for for games, right? Like probably not as long as some people. <laughs> so regardless, I, I feel like that's pretty impressive. Little Grape's gonna play Minecraft. Oh boy. Enjoy your Minecraft, Little Grape. I'm sorry that I'm not Ben, but I can uh I can pretend to be one day. I'm just gonna have to uh I'm just gonna have to eat a small civilization and uh pick up some buildings and we're we're good. And also learn how to sing somehow. Oh boy. Where are we now? This is like a whole nother place. We don't even have the map for it. And there's no bench I've seen yet, so I'm kind of worried. Three people made the game and one of the three people were the, oh, okay, you're saying the whole team was, so you're saying there's only one person on the team of three people, it was three people that made the game in general. Okay, that's, that's pretty crazy. I knew it wasn't a big team, but that's still really wild, man. Because some people will get guest composers for their games. They'll get someone to do like one thing and then someone will do something else, whatever. But even so, I would imagine they probably haven't like been in the industry as long as some of the people that do music. So. Because like, wasn't this, wasn't this the studio's first game as a team? That's kind of weird. I can't even check the, the map. Oh, I've seen this guy before. Frost has an emote of this guy, doesn't he? Or somebody does? Uh, Block, I'm doing pretty good. How are you? 
What's up? Even designed the sound effects too. That's awesome. Yeah, sound design and visuals make this like 25% better, at least. Like it makes up a good portion of what makes the game good. You will grant me the MRRL time if I beat you in GT Sport. I'm going to beat you in GT Sport. And then I will forever change my, my channel name to MRRL time. Or just I'll change it to Ryan Lockwood. You can do that. Where's the heal? Okay, that door is definitely not a door. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, okay, that was, an, that was not good. That was worrisome and I thought the mushroom in the background was gonna kill me too somehow. I'm not a fan of this thing that explodes. to the left over here, hmm. That kind of seems like a boss fight. That kind of seems like a nope right now. Oh wait, wait, oops. Instant nope, instant nope on that, nope. <laughs> Am I raging yet? I haven't raged yet, no. Is this a game that will make me rage, do you think, Lethal? I wanted a game to piss me off for a long time. Mortal Shell definitely didn't piss me off enough. They told me it was going to, too. They said it's gonna be really, really hard. We remember the Elder. It's like a monument. But the thing is, there's nothing standing on there, so that means that he's alive still? Or is it just like a monument that doesn't have a person? I feel like this dude over here escaped or something. This this fight will make me rage, okay. I If I don't get mad enough, you guys owe me one million dollars. The tiny steps of a tiny creature, you got the look of an adventurer. So we've much in common. Searching for dangerous places, eh? Well, you're on the right track. Long necked critter warned me of a tribe deeper down. Warrior sorts, so she says, and I'm itching for some serious combat. Oh, this guy's got a co op partner or something. Okay. I thought that was going to be a boss. Oh, you can jump on these. It's kind of like a weird jump, though. You can't really jump on them. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, I just did something weird there. I think I was supposed to be over here. Maybe. 
I don't think I saw this part before. Oh, duh. Come on, man. I don't have the map for this place, so it's kind of scary. Uh, so impressed by the people in chat who have played this game before. They must be geniuses, and we need their guidance. Eh, some people just uh, like to like to give tips and stuff like that. And I also I have I have asked a lot of questions out loud, so I'm not really bothered by it right now. There's nothing I've seen that's really ruined the game for me so far in chat. So, and this game I did actually watch before I played it, um, like a while ago. So I've seen some stuff in it. There's going to be things I recognize, like character models and all that. I don't know enough to be good at it, but I mean, it's definitely uh, something I've seen. So you can't. I I wouldn't get too mad. I, cause like if, if it was a big deal, if it was like really big deal for spoilers, I would probably be getting pissed off. Uh, here ends the pilgrim's way. Halloness heart lays open for you. Proceed onward and share its own glory. Share in its glory. Sorry, my bad. Yes. And that looked like it was a bridge. So there must be a way to get across there, but we can't do that yet. Yay. Silk Song should be coming out this year. I would hope it is. That and Cuphead DLC. Everyone does that their first time. <laughs> I've done that with other places too. Oh, why did I do that? Why? Oh man, how far back am I? Oh, I don't even know where we are anymore. Oh shit, dude. And I have no idea where this is. Like, did we just go straight down from here? Like, I, well, I know where I know where this is, but I don't, I can't remember that well how to get back to where we were. Look at the broader map. Oh yeah, the double tap map thing. Well, I don't have a map for that other area, so it wouldn't really do anything. can see the entrance. I wasn't even sure. What, I, I that, That's the thing. I, I could see the entrance and like I'm still going to question if it actually is the entrance because there's a hundred different things in this, right? doesn't even matter if I thought I knew what it was. I'm still going to question myself even because I've done that so many times and been wrong. So I wouldn't base off my first assumption on this unless I was a hundred percent like for whatever reason. It shows the shade. Does it? Wait. I can't see it. Oh, it's like way, it's like way outside the map. Yeah, you you actually can't even see it. Wait, so we were we were in Green Path, were we? I don't even think we were. We're just gonna go down here though. I keep dying. Oh, all right. Let's see. We go all the way around there. There's still like a, apparently like a hallway we haven't even discovered on that side either. I wasn't in Green Path. I was in like the other thing. Map orientation's not my skill. No, I don't. I don't do good with that. It's more about actually like playing the game. That's why I can't be bothered to do things that have excess stuff that isn't gameplay. But this is fine though. This isn't really that bad. There has been worse. <laughs> okay, well maybe not now. <laughs> Cause we lost everything. You see it blink for a second when you zoom out, yeah. I was under the crossroads. Damn. Well, now it doesn't even matter where we are. Been playing a lot of non-souls games lately? Ah, uh, I would say so, yeah. Well, actually, I guess not, because, like, this relate. Well, people will relate this to Souls, and then so, same with Mortal Shell, so maybe not. Depends on your preference. For me, I mean, like, that's variety for me, but... Um, I mean, soon enough, I'll probably look forward to going back to the runs I want to do anyways, because it's been a while.
Uh, so we're just gonna go back over here. Or, well, wait, why does it say my thing is down there now? Why does it say it's underneath in here? Doesn't make any sense, does it? Oh no, because I, I died in here, that's why. So, never mind. Don't, don't even, don't even. No one say anything. Exactly where we were before. Got your soul back. Um, I'm at the point where I'm too lazy to do that. I'm sorry. I want to, but I just don't have it in me. I just want to progress. Oh. It's not a lot of, yeah, I didn't really have a lot of stuff on me either. I didn't really die with like a huge currency or a huge amount. Your soul thing is broken if you don't and you can't hold this much soul. Oh, okay, that's fair. That is fair. Okay, so next time then that'll be a good reason to. Honestly, like, before I really didn't care about that as much, but it does actually impact it a little bit, so. Oh, God. Like, you're not going to be able to heal nearly as much. You only get two heals instead of three, I think. Oh, here we go. Easy death here. You can progress from different places. Oh, boy. So you don't have to, like, necessarily go a certain way at a certain time. Uh, is important, otherwise upper left mug won't fill 100%. Oh, I didn't, I jumped there. I hit jump. Oh yeah, so we have a name for this next place. We just have to go down from here, that's what it is. Don't have the map for it. Woke up from your nap and I'm still alive. We're gonna have to be uh, going pretty soon. Um, I just want to see like what happens in this next area. But I appreciate that you uh, you made it back. It's awesome, man. I hope you guys have had a good stream today. I'm honestly like I started it with pr quite a lot of energy. I'm feeling like super super tired now. Though like my brain like I'm literally like I don't even my brain's not even like working at this point. It just feels like there's nothing happening at all. I'm just doing stuff, but I don't really even I'm not really really thinking of it though. Uh, so. It's probably good that we're ending soon, because I don't think I would have been able to stream for another couple hours today. All right. Then we're going down. Although, why can't we go underneath there? It's a place over here. Wait. How does that work? On this side? Here we go. Okay, now we're getting back to where we were. No! <laughs> but it doesn't matter. <laughs> but it doesn't matter though. Oh man. I think I think we're actually gonna end on that. No, it's been six and a half hours, guys. Uh today was like also like a weekend stream and we're gonna be doing streams the entire week until I think when well, we're gonna be we'll do the next two days, then Wednesdays off, and then I don't even know if I'm gonna be taking this weekend off, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, Wednesday's like the only guaranteed day off. Every other day is a stream, as far as I'm concerned. We're going to be doing um, some Mortal Shell tomorrow, some practice for the tournament, and then maybe more of this to get uh, some more progress in it. But we beat one boss at least. That's not too bad. Made it a little bit further. Found an area. It was fun. I had fun. Uh, we're going to find someone that we can raid and host. If you guys want to uh, know me go live, here's the Twitter. And here's the YouTube if you want to see anything you missed. I've been trying to aim for uh, around... I think, like, the best time is 11 a.m. EST, not 10. Because 10 seem still seems to be a little too early for attendance. Versus 11 to, like, just after 6. Um, 
you know, so I think I'm going to try, I'll, I'll still be live earlier than that, but I think I'm going to try to make that like the latest time we're live, um, instead of it be the goal, because sometimes I would prefer to be live a little earlier still. So we're going to do that. Uh, let's see who's live. Give him a host. And I'll try to pick someone that's maybe not playing uh, something that we're going to check out. Or actually, I guess we're done. Mortal Shell and Fall Guys. Okay, never mind. See, my brain's not working. I'm saying shit that make, makes no sense at all. I don't even make sense to myself. Uh, all right. Shesman's playing something. Uh, oh, Annie's playing Sekiro for the first time. We're going to raid Annie, actually. Who apparently has an insanely high heart rate as well. But no heart rate monitor today. Oh. I want to. I want to. <laughs> I want to start a thing where we like start like, like concerning people that having extremely high resting heart rates <laughs> that they're playing th these games. Anyways, I'll see you guys in any.